Are you having trouble with your email integration? This video shows you where to go to find the answers to fix your email integration and how to troubleshoot your email integration. If you want, you can also remove that add-in so you can start over again with a clean slate. So check it out. When troubleshooting, you should start with the extension to see if everything is working properly. In this example, we are using Outlook. Of course, you would go to your Gmail if that's what you are using. Go to the Sales tool and click on it, and then scroll all the way down to the Add-in Settings. Log and Track Settings, there is the Email Integration Setting, and Help and Troubleshooting. Go ahead and check these places first, the Email Integration Setting, as well as the Help and Troubleshooting. If that is not possible and you do want to start from scratch with a clean slate, the best thing to do is to first remove the HubSpot Sales Add in by clicking here, you will receive instructions. As you can see here, our inbox is connected. Things are going well. Of course, if this is not the case for you, you would want to do some troubleshooting by going here or checking your email integration settings. You then want to go into your HubSpot portal. Now that you are in your HubSpot portal, you will want to go to the settings menu and then click on integrations. Open this up and go to email integrations. Now, as you can see here, we are fully connected. However, you have a couple of options here. You can disable or you can remove completely. If you want to start over with a clean slate and reinstall our integration, go ahead and remove it. Confirm that you would like to remove the inbox and I'll give you a few tips and tricks on how to do this. Now, if you want to start all over again, of course, you would go through connecting an email inbox. You can check our video. The link is in the description, connecting your email inbox. 